Hello and welcome back to the channel and today you join me for this week's Falls Thong guide called Up to Speed again which wants you to own and drive the 2002 BMW M3 GTR to complete all the challenges with. So without further ado let's get stuck in. Now this is the car in question, it will set you back 180,000 credits from the auto show or you can probably pick one up in the auction house too. I've also created a tune for you guys, it's called Falls of Thumb, share code is 884-645-620 and hopefully that should help you out. But the first challenge here is super easy and it just wants you to drive 5 miles. So to do this I recommend just driving flat out on the main highway or motorway as you call it. Um, reason for this is just the quickest way to rack up miles keep going flat out until the challenge pops up as complete simple as that now the next challenge here wants you to earn a daredevil skill now this is actually a really simple thing to do but to do it i recommend going into horizon solo mode so i'm already in horizon solo which is why it shows up as horizon life but a daredevil skill is just getting two or three near misses in quick succession so it's really easy to do the reason i recommend going into solo mode is because there are more ai vehicles on the road and the highway still is the best place for this as that's where there is a much denser population of ai cars so it's literally as simple as that three near misses on average uh, in quick succession will get you that now the final challenge here just wants you to earn nine stars at pr stunts so to do this i recommend heading over to the gyro and Covado drift zone this is the lowest scored three star drift zone there is so three stars on here is only thirty thousand drift points super easy to get and of course we're in a rear wheel drive v8 car so why not go for a drift zone you don't have to use this one um, or you don't have to use drift zones end of you can use trailblazers or danger signs whatever you want but i just think the drift zones are probably the easiest ones and especially this one as it's such a short drift zone even if you only get two stars each time it will only take you a couple of minutes to complete the challenge get a total of nine stars so it's really not that difficult to be honest and it's a nice easy final challenge to finish off with but if you are struggling with anything any of the challenges and of course please do let me know down below in the comments i'm more than happy to help you guys out um, as well as that don't forget to stick around because coming up after this is going to be the photo challenge guide for this week as well um, but hopefully this guide did help you out if it did and you're new to the channel i'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe and if it did help you out dropping a like massively helps me out as well but apart from that folks i want to wish you all the best make sure you stay safe and take care